So you've, yep. you've been doing this for a minute. Now, yeah. how I want to talk a little bit about your parents. I know I know your mom meant a lot to you. Um, and she was oh. she was one of those neighborhood moms, right? Like everybody knew her because of how much time we spent in the house. Yeah. Now, how would you describe your parents? I want to start with your, your father first. And then we'll yeah. go into your mother. And like, how would you describe him? My dad... My dad is just real, and he's so old school. He's so, but he's a real, he's real. Like, he's just real. And he's rude. So if you wonder where my, my room is, <laughs> him. But my mom, too. They're both, like, so it's just like a double whammy. Like, it's crazy. Yeah. But my dad is just, he's mad real. He's real. He's mad chill. He's cool. Like, he's a cool guy to talk to and reason mm -hmm. with. Like, he just keeps it a buff all the time. Nice. Tells you as it is. And um as a father, like he's very loving. Like he really, really, really loves his kids. Mm. And um I'm his favorite. <laughs> nice. <laughs> well you're the baby too, right? <laughs> so <laughs> I'm the baby. But, yeah. but um yeah, like my dad's dope, yo. He's mad cool. Mad nice. cool. Nice. My dad. What 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 impact um, did did um did he have is is would you say your mom had more of an impact on you or your dad growing up my da my mom definitely definitely mm. my mother um what does she mean to you but my dad my mom my mom's everything that's my backbone like yeah. Yeah. literally and she's all of our backbone she was the glue for yeah. the whole family not just within our household yep. but just with the cousins too all that she is the she was that glue yeah. she was the reason why any type of family orientation would take place because she was all about family yeah. us getting along and doing certain things when warranted to like during certain like you know little festivities like for holidays and stuff like that she was always for that yeah so that's why every like holiday thanksgiving christmas all of it is at my mom's house Wow. So that's stuff, you know, stuff like that we miss now that she's not here with us. Rest yeah. in peace, my mom. Rest in peace for sure. That was that was a hard. That was definitely a hard loss. Um, it it it's it's crazy because whenever I attend, you know, a loss, a celebration of life, it's it takes a little bit more out of me. Like it, it makes me not want to go to the next one just because mm. of who it is or if it's closer to me. And, and, and so it gets harder. And it, it, one of the hardest ones was obviously um, your older brother's loss, right? So that was a tough one for me to be at. But um, it was good for me in the sense that I got to see him because um, mm. I hadn't seen him in a while. And so we were able to mm. reconnect at that point. But yeah, mom, mm. mom was definitely a, a big loss. And then rest in peace to her and, and you know i think she did an amazing job with not just her own kids but with the rest of us and yeah she was yeah like you she don't you, you don't realize it until you're yeah. older you know what i mean like as kids we don't realize yeah. how impactful other our friends parents were to us indirectly like the fact that she just opened her doors to say come in that's mm -hmm. huge like that was huge and if if there was a barbecue happening everybody would get something you know what i mean like it wasn't like mm -hmm. no this is just for my kids she just opened her doors all the time so that was that was mm -hmm. something that i definitely remember i mean if you look your court was yeah, was like was that <laughs> yeah it was it was on our side yeah it definitely was you know i even i remember um one time because she used to remember my mom had all the parties too yeah so one of the parties she had i'll never forget one of the man mom came storming into the house, into the party, because her son was not supposed to be there. Mm. And she was pissed, came in there, embarrassed the guy. And, you know, my mom stepped in. Not to say, she wasn't stepping in on a, oh, like she wants to be nosy and involve herself in somebody's, you know, parenting with their yeah. child, like it's her business. It was more so like, this is my home. I'm keeping an event where all the you them are welcome. Mm -hmm. You know, it's yep. youth friendly for them. Yeah. You have your issue at home with your kid. You keep that excitement there. Don't come here with it. Yeah. So that's where she stepped in and said, yeah. like, you know, yep. if you want to discipline them and carry on with whatever, whatnot, you have to take it outside. Yeah. You know, and 
people always talked about that. Like yep. even that kid, that person, he's dead right now. To rest in peace to him. Mm-hmm. Rest in peace. But um, that person, he never forgot that. Like yeah. he never, like he just had a different love for my mom after that situation. Because it was yep. like. Yep. she didn't have to do that and it's like even though she wasn't really defending him it was just like fuck it, it, it still saved him like it, yeah. it, it helped helped yeah. him in that situation because he was getting <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, oh, yeah. Just, my mom was just different like that she was Man. different 